Guess what we're doing today? Today we are going to make some super easy gummy strawberry Valentine dog treats. We got all the dogs in here ready to make some treats. This is actually a really, really simple, e easy recipe. There's like three ingredients and that's it. So we're gonna show you guys how to make these real quick. If you wanna see some more Valentine's treat videos, there will be a link up in the cards and down in the video description below. And as always, if you guys are new, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, click that bell to turn on notifications so that you can be notified whenever we put up amazing new videos. Let's make some treats. You're waiting patiently, aren't you? Chevy's like, I'm being very patient. Can we just get on with it? <laughs> So the first thing we're gonna wanna do is take about a cup of chopped up strawberries. First, we'll, we'll see if everybody will eat one. How about strawberry no dip? Oh man. Oh, she ate it. She actually ate it. She didn't spit it out. Strawberry no dip? I know you'll eat it with no dip. <laughs> How about you? Strawberry no dip? <laughs> What's that? Oh, you just wanna lick it? Wait a minute. Oh, we've been here before, haven't we? You liked strawberries. You weren't sure about strawberry. You can eat it. You really, no, she, this is for Oakley. You can eat it, here, here, try it. There you go. Or take it in the other room. That's fine too, as long as you eat it. So anyway, we are gonna take one cup of strawberries, chopped up, and I know this seems silly, but we're gonna take it, pour it into this one cup measure, and then we are going to fill this one cup measure up with water. So we're gonna do that real quick. So now we have our strawberries in our water and we filled it to the one cup line. Basically what we're doing right now is we are going to make strawberry juice. It's pretty much what we're doing. We're now gonna take the strawberries from with the water in this one cup and we are going to pour them into this Nutribullet and turn it into, like I said, pretty much strawberry juice. So now we pretty much have strawberry juice. The dogs are like, wait, what is this? Can we drink it? Kind of, you're kind of gonna drink it, kind of. <laughs> So the next thing we are going to do is we are going to take half a cup of water and we are going to heat it on the stove and we are going to pour in all four of these packets of plain unflavored gelatin. We're gonna whisk it together until this is all dissolved. That's what we're gonna do now. All right, the gelatin is in the water. Now we are just going to continuously whisk this until it is all dissolved. Now once it's all nice and dissolved, it's kind of going to look like this. Now we're going to take that strawberry juice we made, and we're going to pour this in and whisk it together and remove it from the heat. Now to make it a little easier to pour, we have poured it back into our one cup mixture and now we are going to pour this into our silicone heart tray. We're going to fill each of these about halfway. What do you think? Things can turn out amazing? They're like, we're all really patient. We want to know what this is going to do. So we're going to go ahead and take this and try not to make a giant mess. Oh look, I already made a giant mess. I should probably set the camera down while I do this. <laughs> and now our silicone tray is full. We are going to take this and we are going to put it in the refrigerator for, I would say at least three hours. Easiest if you just do it overnight. I'm actually doing it overnight, but I would say three to four hours before they will actually be firm enough that you can remove them from the silicone mold. Which means you gotta have some patience, honey. You and the rest of the girls gotta have some patience. <laughs> While we're waiting for those, let us know down in the comments below. What do you guys want to see us make next? Suggest some treat videos for us to make down in the comments below. You never know. We just might make one of your suggestions next. All right, so we left them in overnight, and they are done. They're pretty cool. So these are the strawberry ones, but as you guys saw in the video last night, I was reminded that we have a few dogs that don't necessarily like strawberry without something else in it. So I also made some plain ones with just a little bit of chicken broth in them. Uh, I'm going to show you guys more recipes and different types of gummies you can do soon as well, but I figured I better have these just in case they really don't want to eat these. But they turned out... They're nice and jiggly, jiggly. I know you want to try it so bad. They're nice and jiggly, very firm, and uh, they smell good. And for those of you that are gonna ask if you can eat these as well, yeah, if you want to eat them, you can eat them. They're basically jello jigglers, but they don't really have any real sugar in them. They just have the natural sugar from the fruit in them. So the girls are gonna go ahead and give them a try and see what they think. Are you girls ready? Is everybody ready to see what they think? All right, let's do it. Sit. So first we are going to give Memphis one of the, ah, wait. 
one of the strawberry ones and I think she's just gonna that's exactly what I thought you were gonna do <laughs> sit she's like these are great I will eat them all can you speak speak that's a stomp speak that was really close speak ah. yeah good girl okay now you get one of chicken broth ones could you eat it a little slower yeah like that nibble 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 yeah little nibbles good stuff was it good was it good stuff all right i think memphis says they're a win all right will she eat the strawberry one you don't, you don't want it you want the strawberry one maybe oh she gonna okay i'm gonna let it go if you're not gonna spit it out this time oh you're are you gonna eat it she's like mm, i'm gonna take it over here and think about eating it shelby you want this one instead shelby you want that want this one instead she's like yeah i want that one instead <laughs> Is that, yeah, how did I know? That one was better, wasn't it? She's like, that? Hi, say hi to the camera. That one was way better, wasn't it? She's like, that one was way better. This one, I'm not so sure. <laughs> you can eat it, it's really edible. It's just strawberry. No, you don't want, do you want that one? She's like, I want it, but I don't really like strawberries without dip. <laughs> Look at the attempt, like, I could eat this, but how about no? <laughs> Alright, let's see what, Let's see if Oakley will eat a strawberry one. Alright, it's Miss Oakley's turn. That's a strawberry one. You gonna eat that one? Even though it's strawberry? Well, maybe they will eat. No, she's like, I oh, don't know. I really want to eat it because everybody else ate it, but I'm not really sure if I should eat it because it's kind of weird tasting. Here, let me get you the other one. You want to try the other one? Try this one. She's like, oh, well, that one That one smells more like chicken. Oh, yeah. She's like, I can eat this one. I'll chew this gummy right up. <laughs> uh, maybe I'll try this one again. Nope. Yeah, you like the other one better too, huh? Yeah. I should remember that you guys aren't a huge fan of strawberry. They like strawberry with other stuff in them, but I think because the gelatin was unflavored, it literally was strawberry flavored. And uh, those two aren't a big fan of strawberries, unlike Memphis, who will eat anything. All right, you guys, well, there you have it. Strawberry gummy Valentine's treats for dogs. You can pretty much do this with any type of fruit you want or add pretty much anything you want to it. I am going to be showing you guys more variations of these types of gummies that you can make for your dogs just for fun as always if you guys have any suggestions for treats you want to see on the channel leave them down in the comments below and if you want to see even more of our valentine's treat videos there will be a link up in the cards and down in the video description below as always if you are new to this channel and you like what you saw don't forget to hit that subscribe button like this video and share it with your friends to help us grow the audience as always thanks for watching thanks for subscribing stay positive dream big and we will see you again soon also, if you guys want to see even more fun cooking stuff, we did start a new channel where we are making food for people. It is over at youtube.com slash snowdogscooking. You can check that out if you want to see people treats. <laughs> we make all this food. I think it makes everybody hungry. So we also make people treats on another channel. So be sure to check that out. Goodbye, guys.